Hello everyone. This is rather a special occasion, so we'll just start it off from the get-go. This colony here I'm showing you right here, this Formica Podzilica, is now three years old. I caught her three years ago this week. As you can see, I caught her from a single queen. I did boot brood booster at the very beginning with about 20 workers. And she has gone stellar since. I was hoping to spot her, but I don't think we're going to get a chance to see her. Unless that's her right there. But this colony is three years old. It's one of two that I have that are three years old. As you can see, doing quite well. They've slowed down on the brood production quite a bit. They're still brood, but not like there was. As you can see. Workers. A little bit of brood. Quite active. I gave them some honey. As you can see, they're starting to really finish it up. That whole bottom thing was filled, and they're pretty much finishing it off. They're in a dual-sided nucleus, special order, with four water towers, two nest mates, museum glass on both sides. Sorry, folks, it's going to be upside down here. As you can see, doing extremely well. Work is all over. As my wife calls her, the ant goddess. When in doubt, folks, tin foil is the best thing to put food on. That way, it don't mold in your form of carrying. Helpful tip. But this is one of my two oldest colonies, and now we will go to my other colony. That is just a couple weeks older than this one. Started from a single queen. This is my Pogo Miramix Occidentalis, three years old, and a labyrinth that they've been in quite a bit. As you can see, plenty of brood. Seed storage. There's more brood around this water tire, but it's hard because it's fogging up. Because it's really dry here in Colorado. We don't get a lot of humidity. But this colony is over three years old now. I caught her about a week and a half ago, which would be, that would be the anniversary, about a week and a half ago, three years. At one point, this colony got knocked down to 11 workers. Through an accident of my own, I cleaned out their old formicarium and, uh, I didn't properly rinse it and uh, killed off all but 11 workers in the queen. And as you can see, they've bounced back very nicely. And this was a gift from Raven Blue, um, Todd Spivey, and a couple other individuals. This formicarium, this labyrinth, which I'm highly appreciative of. I really like it. It's one of my pogos. But this is, these are my babies. My wife's baby colony right there, that's hers. I take care of it, but that's hers. And mine. Three years now. And every day that goes by is a record with these two. I've never been able to keep colonies this long. I've been in this hobby four years now. I've been back in this hobby four years now. And I now have two colonies that are three years old. Thank you, Tar Heel Ants. Thank you very much, Mac. Without you, none of this would have been possible. And thank you for allowing me to enjoy my hobby. Thanks for watching.